Let's go, ladies and gentlemen, we continue with the match. It's gonna be game number five. You can go for the betting and people on YouTube. Enjoy. This is what you have to do. Enjoy and thumb up. Okay, Ghost Leak is a map that, come on, everyone knows. And if you don't, it's kind of easy to explain you. I will sum out, sum out a little bit. It's a land map, face it, you know, like Arabia. All right, there's some hills, not a lot. In the middle, you can't build anything in this ice area. And there's a lot of ships usually, you know. Berbers and Tatars is the civilizations they pick. Usually it's not really complicated to wall. Why? Because even if you see some resources in front, you always get something at the back. It would be very unfortunate that all is forward. Because since you are at the edge of the, close to the edge of the map, not that close, right? Yeah, usually you get something. This time he got a goal. Not the berries. Don't like Mr. Yo map so much. While that map is a paradise. Why this is happening? Because if you check the distance between the TC and the edge of the map, it's much bigger. So a lot more space to have resources. Mr. Yo, look at this distance. Crap, total crap. So he only got two wood at the back and then everything else on front except that goal and very open. Doubt can easily wall like this, then go to the with the buildings, wall this small area, and he got absolutely everything safe to go Castellage. I don't know if you agree, but it's what it is, man. <laughs> we love this game. That's it. That's it. Yeah, and that's the reason. You know? That's the reason. He still have two ship four ships here. Let's see if he's gonna find all the ships. He better go back soon because Doubt is there, man. He's gonna land them all. Ooh. Doubt is coming. He's gonna he's gonna kill them. He's not gonna kill anything. But he was close. Well, he knows now where he is. And do you think he got ships? I think Mr. Yo got some ships, you know? He can go up to Imperial with his food. Oh my goodness. Okay. The other side. Uh, well, Doubt God is still seven, which is fine, you know? Or even more. No, no, no. Nine. There's a lot of resources. A lot of resources. That's why Britons was very popular in this map. Well, no. Because it gives you a huge bonus. It's true that even if I don't like his map a lot, well, with a goal at the back, he might be fine for the early game. The problem is if he's getting pressure, you know. But to be fair, Berbers is an amazing civilization. Tatars too. But I like a lot Berbers in Castle Age. The cheap knights and camels, in my opinion, gives a lot. Obviously, Tatars. Bonus extra with the, with the food from the ships. You get 50% more food. And um, Thumbrin for free. Poof. That boosts a lot. Because if you are able to attack quicker than your opponent with Thumbrin activated, the domination is real, guys. Or it can be real. So it's difficult, man. Okay. What tournament is this? Oh, baby. This is your answer. SE2 and Charity Event. All right. You can check all the information in that comment, guys. All related with that, with the tournament, with the host, with the purpose of the charity, absolutely everything. Go, go, go. Check Wikipedia. Let's go, amigos. Okay, he's walling all the map. And... Uh, what is he planning to do? The DSR are outside. He's gonna go fast castle? I wouldn't be surprised. But wall, please. Don't let him go in. No, he's not going. He don't want to go in. Yeah, and he's fully walled. He has the loom down, okay. While Mr. Yo is still without the loom. Interesting. Very interesting. A second armor came, I believe. Yeah, it's going. So Mr. Yo is going for the fast castle. He loves to play with Berbers. And I'm telling you something then. He's playing like in those two versus two tournaments. Right? In uh, in two pools. And also so much all the day. Go fast castle and then camel arches. Oh man. Camel arches actually kill everything. The problem here is that he does have a stone inside. And that's a huge problem. So I don't think he will go for camel arches. Might go knights. I guess. Yeah. After this villager is doing the loom and going up. 25 villages. One scout. 26 population. And then doubt now what he's going to do. Just wall and not even going to make buildings? 
Oh, he's doing the building, okay. He's gonna go forward to make a tower. Hmm. I don't know if that's this needed. It. It's true that the stone, he doesn't have a stone inside. Yeah, he's gonna make a tower probably here. Or on the berries. Let me go to to Mr. Yo. To Doubt, sorry. Yeah, he's mining a stone, so. Now he's walling, Mr. Yo is around. And uh, Barak. Mr. Yo shouldn't have big problems. Because he's coming with only one village. If he was there already with few villages and pushing fast, then maybe it's a problem. But with one villager and the scout, I mean, that tower will take a while. He will be able to build everything, relax it, completely fine. Yes, it will be annoying. We'll lose, we'll lose a wood line. But by the time that he's losing that wood line, he has already, you see, he has uh, the stable and the blast already built. Remember my words. Yeah, he's coming with another scout. He has three scouts already. I think it's unnecessary what he's doing. Don't think it's the best idea. Seven. Okay, the second tower then is much more annoying because then zero wood, it can be a problem. It can be a real problem. Nah, he's fine. He can't collect the wood here till he's taking those. Mr. Yo. Doing a bill here. Now, stable. And Blasmid, as I told you. One tower here, another tower in the north. Of course, it's, it's good to, de to deny that, but uh, I'm not convinced. I'm seriously not convinced. Don't know what you think, guys. Obviously, he's won in all the map. He's now going to my goal, but his economy? Far from going up. Very, very far from going up. Oh, baby. Yeah, you can see the resources. He's up to castle it already. Up to castle it before he is doing the tower. And that wood is now bye bye. And another wood that is going to be bye bye. Yeah, he cannot see it. That's gonna be annoying, but still he can collect the wood here. I wouldn't be surprised that he make a lumber camp here. If I was him, a lumber camp in this area. Yeah. Anyway, stable. He does have double attacks, no horse collar. He need to make the upgrades very, very annoying. And let's see what he's going to do. Another stable. So he's gonna go heavy aggressive. Whoa. Okay. No horse collar. So I think second stable might be a little bit too much. He has resources, but he has three villages on goal. I'm not sure. Oh, a second tower. Maybe, maybe he should... Nah, it's fine. He will just gonna make it here, the Lamarcam. I was sure about that. No, not there. Maybe even closer, exactly. I like that. Yeah. Okay, let's see what he can do. Castle each time is fast. It's now 6 villages on goal. And with the double stable, time to dominate. Not a single upgrade, no, he has the plus one. Plus one is more than a note to kill those. Still doubt is not up yet. And honestly, mm, let's see what, is, what he can do. Obviously he's gonna, <laughs> look at the walls. <laughs> annoying, very, very annoying. Okay, he's gonna go aggressive with a siege war shot. Why not? Yeah, just go all in. One TC. I mean, one TC push is probably the we the best he can do at this point. And he's sending the villager and the knights. When the knight has come, everything is gone. Market. Okay. No, he has his table. Ooh. No, man! No, man! This is really bad for Mr. Yo, and he can't build quick walls. This is terrible for Mr. Yo. Now sending another villager, but he denied this. And this is exactly what you don't want to happen. 
You don't want to happen. Stop sending a villager alone. Exactly. Two villages is the best way to go. And send the knight. Wow. Well, he denied that. It's still one minute. But he should have the, the siege wars up already built. Because if he has there and make the siege, then it's a big problem. Obviously, he still has a good amount of knights. And not going to be easy to, to counter. But the economy for doubt should be now a little bit better. He has two villages more and he's farming. Okay. Siege workshop. To kill with rams. No. Oh, he's doing double siege workshop. Is not that a lot of investment? Holy shit. I think it is, but hey, we will see. Yeah, he's in castle within five seconds. He got the knights. But now Bloodlines and Forging for Doubt. Mangonel will be there. He's gonna try to kill the towers, probably. Otherwise, the wood is disaster. He's gonna try to kill this one, I believe. Yeah. We will see, guys. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna take this one. Taking this one is fine. You can make a TC here, and you are fine completely. Camels are coming. I don't know if he's gonna send camels. It's only still five knights. He's coming with the mangonel here. He's gonna take villages now. Let's see if Doubt gonna see this. There you go, village down. Not great. Yeah, he's denying the goal. And that's a big problem, if you ask me. Three camels, okay. Might kill the mangonel. He's sending another village forward. Ouch. Mr. Yo, you need to you need to deal with those. Oh, baby. Yeah, that was bad. Like, when you are killing, you need to go back for sure. Okay, and now he's gonna take that tower. Okay, he's taking the tower. He's fine. Bye-bye, tower. A monastery. There you go. The double siege workshop, I'm, I'm not sure. That villager. Oh. Just go away. Mr. Yo is still with one villain more military with this similar, no more army. There is a camel too. He need to attack. Going to come with monks. Uh, he's camel, so he need to send more camels as well. Now he's going. Now the uppers are better. Uh, Bloodlines, he's going back. Very close. No, no, no. Well, when, the, when he's doing the camels, now he's doing the market. Oof. Snowball game for... For Yo, we will see. He did the monastery, but no goal at all. And now a town center in this area. But problems. Yeah, he has not a lot of resources. He's now taking that tower down. He's gonna make the TC. There's a villager though going. No, no, no. Need to go back. And not a single monk. Yeah. 42 villages, Mr. Yo is still. Whoa. Okay. Still coming with more army. Yeah, he's fine. He can't stabilize, but... He's still attacking the tower. He's not attacking the Magonel. That's kind of weird. Horse Collar now. And Monks. The Monks will help a lot because he's going to heal all those units. Yeah, and the next TC for Yo need to be in front. If he's not doing, he's in big problems. Because he won't... Be able to keep with the, with this goal during all the game, obviously. A TC here is perfect. You take the stone and the goal. Yeah, he's killing those. But then what you prefer? Tatars or Berbers? I think Berbers. I mean, Camel Arches from Berbers? Kill everything from Tatars. Honestly. Maybe not the Siege runs, but, but that's it. Okay. Yeah, but it's, it's nice. It's very nice. One, two, stable. Yeah, second TC, man. He need to add the third TC. Now Doubt is doing the third home center as well. He got the monastery. No relics yet. He's gonna take the siege war shot. All right, but that's nothing. That's really nothing. Still the same village number, so all good. I think he's gonna buy a stone now. Or he should buy. He, he has fight. Uh, 95 stone. He's taking relics. Mr. Yo, healing all the units. And time to, well, time to gather five of stone. Ooh. Oh, that's a pity. And he lost a villager. There you go. Pozo will borrow, not the upgrades, not heavy plow, 
Yeah, he need the upgrades, Mr. Yo. His economy looks weak in terms of, of upgrades. Phyllis is just almost the same. But he's doing Will Barrow. He got Heavy Plow, Bozo. Good economy for Doubt. So you better be careful. He's now going to gather the stone and all to make a, not a TC. It should be here. Like 100%. But now, the battle that can begin. It's so, so important. Bloodline's already there. Probably chain bar the armor soon if he can. TC in that area. He's gonna make it. It was suspected. Great tone center. Now with the camels, need to go back. He's going to convert. Coming with the knights. He has to convert with the monks. He has one monk that is gonna pick the relic. But you need to fight now. This is a problem here. He's trying to convert. Oof. Oof. Well, that camel will take the scout. Take it. Got it. There you go. And now, time to convert camels. He has three monks. Three monks. If he converts those, ooh. Well, he has one only. But the conversions is so important. He needs to convert another. He's going to convert or not. Ay, ay, ay. This battle. This battle is for? For doubt. Because he got more camels. I don't know. He's bringing more monks and coming with the camels. He's difficult. The monks are helping a lot. And now, Mr. Yo is taking taking the battle by far because this amazing Berber civilization is so difficult in Castle Age. So, so difficult in Castle Age. He's gonna kill now the monk. We're gonna take that knight as well. No, no, no. He's gonna kill it for sure. He's trying to kill the monk, but he can't. And amazing battle for Yo. 18 army, 9 army. Yes, doubt with more villages. But now, Mr. Yo and Nodet is in top of that hill. He's mining gold. He can mine stone if he want. And Berbers is so so complicated. Four villains more. Let's see the Castle Age battle here. Husbandry as well. Still, I think Mr. Yo need to make economy upgrades because the economy upgrades for, for Doubt are amazing. But military wise is much better for Yo. He's gonna go forward? We will see. Same part in armor, it's crucial as well. Problem for Doubt only got the plus one attack. He does have the armor. And now he's switching to Cav Archers. Honestly, I'm not sure if this is a good time to go for the switch because he has no fletching no not any upgrade so it's difficult to switch now i think with the cav archers you should go earlier and then you get the advantage let's see maybe maybe it's gonna work obviously all the upgrades will be needed you got thumbring he will need ballistic as well and he's doing four five archie ranges whoa oh, no four archie ranges he's gonna attack he need to attack we will see and he's doing more stables as well. Oh, baby. One is doing a lot more stables. The other is going for Archie Ranges. Yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. Stop sending the Magonel alone. Are you for real? Now the monk is sloppy, yo. Well, you can see how the players don't pay attention for, for two seconds and lose one monk and the Magonel. Terrible, man. Terrible for yo. Yeah? With one scout, you know? <laughs> With one scout. Disaster. He's not mining a stone. And now fletching. So he's doing the transition already. And obviously, Cavarches and Camels. If Mr. Yo is not attacking, be careful, man. Now we'll borrow. The economy for Doubt is still amazing. Like, seriously. Four tone centers. 14 villages more. But. Oof, so many Camels, man. So many Camels with Husbandry. Ay, ay, ay. Well, but he has a couple of monks. He needs to kill the monks. At least so many units. He's going to try to take the battle. He's going to be able to do the job or not. Let's put all these there. He's so many camels, guys. 17 camels. And he's not losing anything, Mr. Yo. I told you that that transition wasn't ideal. The Cav Arches, you need to mass a lot. Economy for Doubt, amazing. The military from Doubt. Boop, 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 boop. 100 villages, 80 villages. Now doing all the average he was missing. He's gonna go forward. He need to go. P -p Push. Mr. Yo, three relics. And now Siege War Shop. The Castle Age is one of the best age for Berbers. You can spam camels and knights forever. They are cheap. They are cheap or if not cheap, cheaper. And that always helps. And now the chain part in armor, it's needed. But guys, doubt is about to go up to Imperial. But... I have seen these kind of games more without. He tried to go up to Imp. But then he lose all the army and get wrecked. 
So he has to be really careful. Hold now the position and go up to Imperial. He's missing the building. And now he's gonna make a castle. Oof, a lot castle in danger, guys. Okay, this is Mr. Yo point of view. He's doing a mind girl, but he's having luck. If if Mr. Yo is going at this point, if Mr. Yo is going, oh my goodness, but he's not going, Mr. Yo. Passive Yo in the house. He need to go. He's not going 50%. About castle is not gonna ha ay 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 now the outpost. Oh boy. Oh boy. He was there now coming with the camels, but it's late. It's really, really late, probably, or not. It's never late for Adult Castle. It's never late. It's never late for Adult Castle. Oh, my goodness. And now with the camels, with the... Oh, baby. He's doing the Adult Castle. I can't believe it's happening over and over and over and over again. With six villages. You need to go with 20 villages. And now, Doubt is losing the game. Or can't lose the game. Unbelievable. Okay, he's going to kill, he's going to convert the villager, the three mangonels. Oh, baby. Classic doubt, but he is still with the huge boom. How many villages he's gonna lose? Guys, let's see. He's three mangonels, but he's losing now. Losing more villages. Okay, he has a lot. This is what he needed before, man. This is what he needed before. Still losing more villages. All right. Yo is now five villages ahead, but... The advantage is for, for doubt. He's an Imperial man. And now those Cavarches get Parthian Tactics for free. For free. But this castle is a good castle. And Mr. Yo about to go up to Imperial. Okay, a second castle. All right. But seriously, in my opinion, he has a huge advantage. Now he still have the advantage, but it's not a huge one anymore. He's going to be able now to deny that one. No, no, no. He won't do it. He's Imperial Age, but he need to make that castle. Or now it will be the same position for Yo. Alright, need to go back. No, no, no. Don't go to the castle. It's gonna go Keshik. Keshik. Alright. In Imp, who win? Ooh. Same villages now. All the arbors for both. No ballistic. That castle forward. <laughs> Seems he's up faster. He might lose that castle. If I was Mr. Yo, I was doing that castle here. 100%. Seriously, here. It's true that he will take a while. He will take the time to kill this castle. So he will give time him to go by with those villagers and regroup army here with the camels. Right? Yes. Gonna mine a lot of stone. And now with 112 villagers, he has a good economy. 35 farmers. Same than doubt. Same than doubt. And both with four town centers. Yeah. I think this castle is just to gain time. Honestly, yeah, this castle is better. Look at this one. In top of that hill, I have more stables. So, camels forever. Full camels berbers. Full camel berbers versus cab archers from Tatars. He's coined with them. Yes, but he has a lot of camels. He got three monks. Those cab archers won't do too much at the moment. But the problem is not that they won't do too much at the moment. Is that in Imperial, when he's doing the, the heavy camels and all the abris, is gonna be even more complicated. Ooh. Okay, let's see the battle. He needs to go back. So many camels, but still those camels are plus two, plus two. No, no, no. No, no, no. How many? 13, 16. Ah, bonus. He got chemistry, need to go back in my opinion. You don't want to take the battle when you can make a plus four and heavy camels. It's real, he's gaining more and more time. And seriously, Berbers in... Yeah, it's very nice. Tatars as well. He got now similar army, he need to go back. But Vilis is the same. Vilis is the same, another good castle. And if he's going now camel archers, oh boy. Camels and camel archers are sick. And this... Is so annoying. It's walling the goal. Oh, baby. Ha, he saw it. All right. Nice. Heavy camels going with the cab arches. The good thing is that Mr. Yo is now located in a way that he can't really get any damage at home. Doubt, similar to. But I'm very, very afraid for doubt that 
the army from Yo in Imp when he's doing all the upgrades and if he's adding camel arches, what the hell he can do, really? Yeah, those heavy camels are already there. Heavy camels are already there. 20 HP more. Doing the upgrades as well. While those heavy cav arches are fully upgraded. No, they are missing the plus 7. The last armor. But they are getting there. They are getting there. Three castles. And now, coming with those. Doubt 41 army. Mr. Yo 27. So, he's gonna do what now? Camel archers? Yes. He's starting to make camel archers. And I believe that with 50 farmers, he will also add hazards. But I insist. Oh, he wants to kill the traps. Yeah, killing the traps is very important. Because he can't push without traps. I mean, if you lose some camel... Uh, uh, damn, heavy camels. It's very important to kill three traps. And now, you can go away. Yeah, still he lost quite a lot of camels. Oh my goodness, he's losing a lot of them. Yeah, but the camel arches, man. He need time for camel arches. Doing the average Kassars, Thambrin, now university. He didn't have anything? What the hell? Another caster here. Wow. Man, I like it, man. I like those games now that we are getting into Imp and see this amount of army. A lot of heavy cab archers. Mr. Yo got less army, but his army is scary if he's able to make them Imperial camel archers. Yeah. That, but that's the problem. He's still with only plus one. Now Ballist is gonna lose some villains. No, no, no. No, no, no. Those camel archers are so weak, man. So weak, amigo. Oh, baby. Well, Hazars. Now the camels. I don't know if now he should delete that house, probably. I still, he has a lot of them. And those are plus seven heavy cab archers. Plus seven heavy cab archers. Taking a lot. They are so tanky, guys. So tanky. I don't know why he's sending army there. He should wait. He should really wait for those camel arches. Why he's wasting a lot? Or maybe you send Hazars. I mean, sending Hazars is fine. But now the camel arches are there. And you will see with the camel arches how he will start to eat the heavy cab arches. Eat the heavy cab arches for sure. All right. The stable here. And 44 farmers, 53 elite Keshik. Oh, baby. Elite Keshik right now. And 1,000 1, stone more for Mr. Yo. You know where I will do it? Here, man. Make the castle here. Mr. Yo, castle here, man. Come on. It's true that he's in danger, but if you, the Trevichet are coming, but you protect all your forward. No? Castle here. Or where he's gonna make it? I don't know. He has 1,200 stone. Those are camel arches, not fully abraded now with chemistry. He has to be careful. 29 army, 68. He need a lot more army, Mr. Yo. He's gonna be able to do it? That's another question. But Hazard's here to raid. Oh, baby. 1,200 stone is still not doing... Imagine if he did the castle, man! He doesn't have the castle. I don't know why, but he has the stone. Just make the castle now. He's not doing... Now those camel arches is starting to get all the upgrades. He's missing the elite, which is obviously very important. But, yo, amigo, where's the castle for yo? He has a lot of resources, and hazards are raiding already. Plate bard in armor, 60 farmers for yo, 55. A lot of cab archers. Those camel arches with hazards, I insist, they are deadly. And now. With the elite camel arches, let's see what Doubt can do. Obviously, the numbers are in favor to him. But, quality or quantity? What do you think, guys? Hmm. I would say quality, but uh, it depends how much he has, right? Yeah. Okay, he's still spamming, man. He's still spamming. Big battle incoming. It's still a lot of stone. A lot of stone by Mr. Yo that he's not using. Maybe he wants to, to keep the army to try to go forward and make casters forward instead of defensive. But still, he has a stone to make two, man. Military numbers now a lot for both. But those heavy, sorry, elite camel arches are now fully abraded. Fully abraded and now he's doing siege. He's doing siege right now. Let's go. Okay, Kassars and Camel Arches, look at the battle now. The elite Camel Arches are gonna eat the heavy Cav Arches. They are doing, man. They are definitely eating, man. They are definitely eating, which is crazy. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, 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 ay. 
Okay. Numbers? Better for Mr. Yo. The score was 2,000. He want to get the hills. As you can see, he ignored this area. He go for the hills. And now, he's gonna raid more and more. He... I don't want to say let, but now Mr. Yo is full, full with Berbers. And that's a problem. A real problem. You can see those heavy cab arches. Oh my god. They just get destroyed by the camel arches. They got a special bonus against cab arches. And now with few Kassars, he raid completely. And now even the Magabri camels, man. I think this is that the regeneration for the camels are faster. You know? I think he the Kasma is for make uh for make 25% faster from the from the castles. I don't think he did that upgrade, but this is starting looking more and more complicated for, for him. He did elite Kashik, but how many elite Kashik he did? Actually, six. That's not a lot, man. He's going in, trying to raid. I'm not sure about that that approach because if he's losing that army inside, it's gonna be terrible, you know. Yeah, he's gonna kill the economy, but whoa. Okay, a lot of Kassars now, those Kassars plus 5, the Camel Arches in that spot, but they need to put all together. Military numbers for Doubt, 86 army, man. So huge amount of army. This is going a little bit laggy because Capture H is, it has this promise in late game. But this is so many units, so many units, and Doubt got now a lot of army. If he's losing these units, it's a disaster for Mr. Yao. At the Satic, he's trying to migrate against the Cab Arches, but man, he's kind of corner. Oh, baby. Yeah, look at this. He's trapping himself. Okay. Obviously, he has more army at home. Resources. Guys. Mr. Yo. Four relics. Four relics. And that's a problem. A real, real problem. I don't know if you agree, but... It's a real problem. He's still killing more and more cab archers. Yes, he's going away. And now he needs to run away. But four trebuchet, man. Four trebuchet. I don't know if he's going to be able to kill those. Still a lot of farming for both players, but down with 80 military. And killing all those units. Two traps? No, no, no. Need to repair that castle. And now go with all the full Hussars. That's the good thing. Hussars is just food. You can make Hassars forever and you want to kill the Trebuchet right now. Camel Arches are trying to support now. Okay. He's also here with Rams. Whoa. He's playing at the same time. Very, being really annoying. Gonna take that trap. I think he will kill that one. He's gonna take another. Need to kill that one. The Camel Arches is still alive. They are so tanky. Military numbers is still down with more. But he's losing some big, big units here. So I don't know for how long he's gonna be able to keep the production down. 65 farmers is amazing, but 58 is very close as well. All right, he hold it, and now he's not raiding anymore. Just mass more army. All right, doubt with so many units, Mr. Yo as well. Pretty sick. No, amazing game so far, as you can see. We are having some good luck. Yesterday, some really good games. Today, another really good game. Happy to see those games, right, guys? Yesterday with Jordan and Hira. Today, without a Mr. Yo. Good players, man. Good players. Good games. All right. He's going back a little, but Doubt playing amazing. Sending so many units. No, no, no. He's spamming so much. Look at the minimap, guys. In the minimap, you see how they are coming like a small... So... <laughs> Look at this. Small ants or miguitas that are coming and non-stop spamming. Pity that you can, well, build here to p -p push. Mr. Yo is unable to keep the production. Seems that the Lord, with only one relic, it's able to dominate. The Keshiks are helping a lot, but the Camel Archers is still there. Very, very tanky. Need more Hussars. Need more Hussars. Probably he will make them more farmers. Still, he has 800 foot, so yeah, he's spamming now with so many Hussars. So many Hussars. Military numbers is still. Ahead for doubt, but not that big difference anymore. Raiding a little, but he got two castles here, no problem. Okay, and... Well, it's still Hazard's being annoying. It's good to distract, to disturb, you know? Okay. This is the armor for the Hazard. You can see right now below me. 2.5, well, the Hazard's from Berbers. It's, well, it's not a big difference, actually. 
Yeah, it's one more in both, in melee and uh, melee units and uh, Pierce armor. One more, one more extra. So he's obviously important, very strong. Very, very strong. Coming with the two traps. Are those trebuchets with the upgrades? No. Remember that Tatar's tech give, well, with Siege Engineer, 19 range. 19 range. He didn't make that one. Obviously, it's an expensive one. And in a 1v1, ugh, it's complicated. We are in Imp. And in Imperial, right now, Mr. Yo with 120 villages. Doubt 117. 72 and 82 military. More for doubt. Forgot to mention, guys. Well, I did, but now even more. Ooh, you need to wall there because he's getting raided. And one fellow is going to go down. Down. Siege rams can appear in the game. And if he's coming with the siege rams, careful. Be careful. Really, really careful. Oh, he's not killing. Okay, now he's walling. There you go. And the camel arches are coming. He's going to repair that castle. He has no stone. So he's gonna give up that castle. He's giving up that castle for sure. He need to micro the camel arches as good as possible. Mr. Yo is taking the lead now. He has, guys, 30 villains more because, guys, Yo is raiding down like crazy. He's raiding down like crazy with those two stables. It's incredible. It's really incredible. The raid is just huge. Daud is still a lot of farming, but he need to kill now. Why he need to kill now? Why he need to kill now? Because if he's losing that army, he won't be able to keep producing as much army. Because he has no food anymore. No food anymore. And he lost a lot of villages. 82 villages is definitely not the note. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, he's gonna lose some villages too. But he's taking a lot. And now with the camels, he's killing everything. More army for Yo. And sadly for doubt, he's probably going to lose the game. And... Well, sadly as well, we can't go for a decider. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Man, this rating has killed so many. He got like 60 farmers, 70 farmers, and now, well, 52 is still okay. But 82 villages. Doubt 39 army. Mr. Yo. Playing amazing. Doubt too, but, uh, well, he was... Just check the minimap. Mr. Yo has protected his base completely with the castles. And the TCs as well. So, never got raided. He raided one time. Kill it. Look at the Echo KD. Mr. Yo has killed 100 villages to doubt. And probably 50 was in the last raid. Pretty much. Yeah, now he's killing completely. And doubt. It's unable to push Yo back anymore. This is going to be the 3-1. And, uh, well, amazing. Amazing game so far. I forgot to mention that now... In this same tournament, oh my god, I forgot completely that it's gonna be Nikov versus Fire. GG, well played. Obviously, in the late game, those camel arches, amazing. They just take everything. But the truth is that who was aggressive was Mr. Yo. He was even pushing, you know? Was even pushing. So he was playing aggressive as well. And that did that transition to cav arches. And honestly, I think that lost the game when the doubt caster happened. Not because he lost a lot, just because he gave enough time to Mr. Yo to catch up in army, in economy, and recover. I don't know if you agree, but that's what it looks. Now, 3-1, guys, for Mr. Yo. Let's analyze. Yeah, they are the truth. Well, uh, Mr. Yo is one of the best for a reason. Doubt too, so no shame to losing versus Mr. Yo, but definitely was a very nice game. Military. Uh, Yo and Doubt kill more or less the same. Economy, uh, what more for Mr. Yo? Food, almost the same, but a little bit more for Doubt and more gold for Yo. Remember, guys, also four relics, 4k more gold. Look, well, 3k more gold, you know? That's crazy. Crazy and amazing. Hopefully, guys, you have enjoyed.